hello hello guys how are you all doing i hope everyone is having a great weekend um yeah in today's video i'm talking about wiseman daniel as you all know uh wiseman daniel was one of the um was one of the apostles of um prophet tv joshua and um in his record i have never seen a prophecy that it didn't come to pass most of his prophecies are accurate um just check his record nothing he said that doesn't come to pass um yeah i've been watching his program for a long time now and whenever he prophesizes um the pro prophecy always gets uh, confirmed that is true um i have never seen any of his prophecies that didn't come to pass uh, as you also can see in this video this young man has never even revealed to wiseman daniel why he came to the church because he came to confirm whether uh, truly uh, he should continue to preach the word of god to people he never told wiseman daniel that he is a man of God. He never told um, Wiseman Daniel, but during the prophecy, uh, Wiseman Daniel prophesied um, that he is carrying a Bible and he confirmed it that is true. Uh, also, this woman, because she also came, not sure which country again. Anyway, she came to the church and during the prophecy time, uh, Wiseman Daniel told us that she's very prayerful and she confirmed it to her that yes, it's because of uh, late prophet T.B. Joshua. You are very prayerful. Yes, sir. By the grace of God, because of her father, prophet T.B. Joshua. Uh, prophet T.B. Joshua taught her how to pray and ever since then that she has been, I think she's from Namibia or uh, Zambia, I'm not sure. Ever since then, she has been praying. She she is also a, a woman of God. So she is a prayerful person, as she confirmed. So Wiseman Daniel has never prophesied, and it doesn't come to pass. All his prophecies are always accurate. When I say accurate, they are 99.9%. I have never seen um, any of them that didn't come to, you know, um, that didn't happen as he always, you know, prophesied. So this could be the reason why a lot of people come from all over the world to come and see Wiseman Daniel. Um, it's not only Nigerians uh, visiting his um, church in Abuja. There's different countries as well that comes. All the wise men of late prophet T.B. Joshua have never failed. Um, all of them are doing great jobs wherever they are. Um, they are, they are well-trained. For I know that this will turn out for my deliverance through your prayers and the provision of the spirit of jesus christ if you believe in prayers if you believe in the holy spirit the living god because this wise man believes in god and god is using him to deliver a lot of people if you believe in god and have faith and go to wise man daniel prayers will be answered as you go to visit wise man daniel because it's only god that is using him he's not by his own power so whenever you are going for deliverance believe that you will be delivered believe that your time has come and nothing will stop you from getting your deliverance through this wise man and as you're doing that the lord will remember you as it says in second chronicle chapter 20 verse 17 
you need not fight in this battle station yourself stand and see the salvation of the Lord on your behalf O Judah and Jerusalem do not fear or be dismayed tomorrow go out to face them for the Lord is with you the battle is not yours the fight is not yours leave the battle for God God will find a solution to those problems and that is why God has positioned his servant wise man Daniel to deliver you all those problems that you cannot solve yourself God is watching to help you out do not be dismayed do not be discouraged for God is with you always believe in God because there is no other one except him he's the only God that we have he's the first he's the last is the Alpha, is the Omega. All those situations that seems you can't solve yourself, hand it over to God. God is able to do it. God is able to deliver you. Do not panic, do not fear, for God is with you. When you go in the house of the Lord, believe and trust God. Remove any fear. Because sometimes fear does a lot of things in our lives that we don't believe that prayers can work. Yes, this man of God, he prays and God does hear him. So when you go to his church, remember that God is still God, that God will answer you. And your problems shall be solved any situation that led you to his ministry god will locate it and solve your problems for you and as you say amen your life will never remain the same god will transform it god will change your situations god will turn everything around for your own good in the mighty name of jesus christ lord i pray amen thank you for watching God bless you all. Tara, bye-bye.